I don't want to take that up. I will go ahead and mark these. Uh-oh. Yeah, we'll do that. Three, four, five, six. So that's six sections of road there. One, two more here to finish that one. Uh, this will actually be done all the way there. We're going to have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen constructions to get that long road done. What I might do is I might do to this first field here and get this long road done. So we'll kind of work on this corner. Next year, get all of this done and this done. Year after, this done and this section. And the year after that, we'll get this and this. Well, although, we're trying to work on this now. And then we'll start doing a similar project in order to get asphalt done. Dump trucks are trying to do the Lord's work here. Uh, let's set them to 3,000. I definitely want them to grab everything that they can. That'll get them busy. Yeah, there they go. We're at 1.5 million. I think we can actually double our export to 30,000 just by upgrading these roads. Um, how are we doing on Ruble Land? Ruble Land is not doing great. Twenty nine tons of crops, hundred twenty four tons of or twenty nine tons of food, hundred twenty four of crops. We are moving more and more of just the food. And we are able to handle more people here. I might need more buses. I also need to upgrade roads here as well. Um, we did get a significant portion of this upgraded very quickly. I might try and do big sections of this all at once. Like, I might just mark this whole area and just get it done the second winter is here. Mm. No, I want to do the main road here first because I need to have some path for my trucks to keep working. So it'll be like this section. And you know what? I'll get that little section there. It'll cut things off temporarily, but long term it'll be worth it. Do I have any trains showing here? Oh, interesting. It doesn't show the trains actually on in the station. Huh. Who knew? Do I have this marked to receive fuel? I do. Why are you not receiving fuel? Train distribution office. Oh! It took you this long to get fuel over here? That's kind of funny. What is Senior Construction Train doing right now? He's still stuck trying to move... Hmm, hang on a minute. Let's try this. Waste truck. Big garbage truck. Let's get one of these big garbage trucks here, and I'm going to try and tell him to grab just from here and export. That may or may not be the right move. We'll find out.
Got another construction finished. Good. Another big road. What's this? Mark P. Is this even faster or bigger than what we already had? Mark P. Dumper. 12 times 90 kilometers per hour. Well, that's nice. Um, show me covered hull. There it is. Nope, still just the marquee. Uh, what about open hull? Mark P. Flatbed Trailer. You are... Huh. I wonder which one of these would actually be best for grabbing containers. Because one of these might actually be really nice. Wood trailer. Oh, would you look at that? That's actually... 23 tons of wood. You can move a lot with that. That's good until 1980 when it disappears. So many vehicles that we can do things with. How's construction doing over here? Um, everybody's busy. It's just gonna take time until we actually get what we need. Is the village emptying out as we go? I think it might be. I think we're slowly killing the village a little at a time. Um, what I will do though, is I will say... We will allow citizens to move into the city. Um, same thing goes for Soyuz. Are we getting citizens in here? We have no party officials here. Why do we have no party officials? We went from having a whole lot of people that were teaching to having nobody teaching. Why? Let's actually turn that off. I will leave Soyuz on because I think people are moving here slowly, probably dying off immediately. Um, garbage is a problem. We've got two distribution offices on the way. Do I not have a technical office? I do not have a technical office. We need to make sure that that's a thing. Um, let's get that done maybe here. Technical services. There you go. I will allow that to build again. that done ASAP. Okay, good. We have enough coal here that we can keep this running for a while. These people can't reach it. Um, let's make sure we upgrade this gravel here. Can you be reached now? Yeah? Let's upgrade the rest of it to gravel. Who can reach it? All of these buildings can. I think I need more of these low quality rural flats, but uh... We're not there yet. Let's figure out heat exchangers for some of these areas. So, first things first.
One there. Do one like right about here. That will get everything over to that side. And we can get one more over this area. Let's see if we can figure out heating pipes. Um, oh, there we go. I need... I was trying to figure out why it wouldn't let me do any side angle snapping, but now I've figured it out. Um, let's get you... wow. There. Get you over here. Okay, so we got one connection point there, and we got one connection point here. I think what I want to do is take you on a line straight out here. Oh, come on now. There we go. And back up. Oh, it's fighting me because of the wiring. No, 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 no. We're not doing that. Uh, get rid of this. What the... No, no, no. Alright, let's see if we can do it this way instead. Get rid of this. Connect you. Nope. Grabbed the wrong pipe. Didn't grab it where it needed to. There. Okay, take you down to here, and let's see if we can connect you in a way that makes some kind of sense. Let's say from here. Wrong one. Won't do a short distance. I'm gonna grab a slightly longer one. Get to there, get to there, done. Um, did that not connect properly? No, it really didn't. Alright, let's try this one more time. Better. That that's a lot better build all of them. So that's our heat. Let's figure out water and sewage. Um, so things I'm going to need. Sewage tanks. So I need to be about here to get these. That's one. So that kind of gets everything up to like this corner. What do I need to get everything over on this corner? That's gonna be two. I'm kind of like dividing it up in quadrants. This is a quadrant, this is a quadrant. Now I want everything here. Um, what do I need for you? Do I need to actually get this? Yeah, I do. Okay. Hmm. 
hook that up. Um, do I need anything here? I don't need to hook those up. Okay. There's a third one. And we're going to need something over here. I'm probably going to need two over here. Or three. Or four. Get that. Get this. And get one here as well. <clears throat> now, what I need to figure out is sewage switches. So, crap flows downhill. We already know this is a function. So, I will connect you here. I should have done this much, much sooner. Um, procrastination is the enemy of progress, and I am fond of procrastination. It's uh, definitely a flaw of mine. Let's get more and more and more. Tell you what, I would like to have one right here. that. Alright, so first things first, <coughs> excuse me, I know that I need to have you hooked up here. That's going to be the pricey one. Now, you can hook up over here, I think. Start laying this out, and it should start making some sense. I'm going to do all of my big pipes first. Um, we're going to need another switch here. Okay. Oh, yeah, this is a problem, too. You need a direct exit. So we're going to need a switch here. Nope, that's not a switch. You're a switch. Hook that up. Let's just do a medium one into here. And we'll do just a small one into there. But you... Get a large pipe. Go like there... Get another sewage switch on this side, I think. Big sewage pipe over here. Great. Small one, big one. Uh, 
The more I run it under the paths, the more these uh, little manhole covers actually make a lot of sense. They're kind of cool. See if I can do, do something like that. Connect that there, connect that there. Oh, requires plop. Oh, you are such a jerk. Proper slope, suck it. Mmm, you don't want me to do what I want to do, and I don't like it. See, it's totally fine if I do it like this. But the moment I try and connect one pipe to another, it doesn't like it. Small pipe to there. Big pipe, come over here. Connect you there. This is complicated as hell. Oh, that's not gonna work. Okay. Because we need something to hook this one up. Uh, let's go ahead and get... Where'd it go? So I'm going to put this on regular play speed for a little while. Um, how are things going over here? Just I, I want to take a quick peek. Since I've had this on fast forward for a hot minute. I want to make sure that everything is flowing the way it needs to be. Yeah, it's all trying to. Stuck behind a lot of tractors, that's totally fine. We're down to 4,900. 4,900, great. Uh, starting to get some of our last few roads done. How are things going over here? Oh, we actually have resources on the construction site for some of these things, so we're not far from having oil started. Very cool. Yeah, it looks like things are going pretty smoothly here. I'm going to have to do water and sewage over here soon as well. I'll make sure that that's my next priority. Come on over here. Uh, let's see if we can cancel sewage here. Okay, fine. I'll do it this way. Get one more sewage switch. We'll do this. Ta-da! Big pipe goes here. Medium pipe here. So that can stay. Uh, small pipe can go here. And then you can have... Actually, honestly, you probably have a small pipe... Does this look dumb? I think it looks kind of dumb. I think we could do better. That section's not terrible. That, that part's not awful. Um, hook up the small pipe. I probably could favor the main road here a little bit more. So what I think I'll do... That's a switch, right? Um, let's go ahead and just grab this. Oh, you know what? I actually had favored that somewhat. Do I need to make that look any cleaner than it is? No, we're actually... We're doing okay here. It's fine. I'm critiquing myself too much.
Oh, no, 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 no. There's no slope here. There is absolutely no slope. There, there's no, there's no problem with slope. No, don't do this to me. Oh, you're such a jerk. Hmm. Okay, okay. Okay, suck it. <laughs> uh, we got it. We got it. Um, let's go ahead and get a small one here. Now, the problem is I'm not really planning for expansion. Um, so. <clears throat> although, I do have multiple things here. No, I think we're okay. We're okay. We have water well here. You're pumping water up to this tower. Great. So we actually do have water starting. We just need water treatment somewhere. Did I have a water treatment set up? Yes. Okay. Big pipe. Yay, I got a big pipe. That's what she said. That sounds wrong. Um, I've been playing this for so long, I think I'm losing my mind. And I'm just saying absolute nonsense. Okay, that is water supply to this area. Now we need big water tower. This is our fresh water. Um, I think I want that right in the middle of town. Water substation. Begin. Let's go ahead and get you set up here. Don't want to be closer here. Yeah, I do. This is going to be our starting point. Alright, so right here on the corner of this road, sometimes it's hard to see what I'm doing because of the... What you call it? I'm gonna have multiple pickups here. Do you not need... Oh, you want water, too. Of course you do. Of course you do. I knew that. How silly would it be if you didn't have water? Let's tell you what. We'll give you a water pickup as well. You've got your own water station. Anything else on the outskirts that needs water? No. So, this... How about each neighborhood gets its own water? You get water, and... You get water. Everybody gets water. Three... Um, you guys are going to be the edge of what I want to supply. So we're going to go ahead and do this. Spin it around. Ta-da! You guys get water. Does anything here need it? Sort of. Kind of. Maybe. Um, is there a more efficient way to do this by just having all of my water switches set up first? That's a good question. Hey, gee, what if I had a water switch set up here? 
So, you guys can go this way and go any freaking direction you want. And you guys can go this way and go any freaking direction you want. Right? Right. So, water tower out. From there, let's see. Oh, that's actually nice. I can see that, so I can kind of get a basic idea of the layout. I can't see my piping, but I can see the water switches and where I need to get them. So you can supply there. Okay, we'll have another water switch right here, so you can supply right there. Um, we'll put this over here so that you can supply up there and over. We'll put this here just in case I need to route it elsewhere. If I need to route it up, down, or past, we can figure that out. We want to route up this way, and we can go left and right. Um, we're going to do the same thing here. This is probably extreme overkill. I'm just going to tell you right now. I don't know what I'm doing with water yet. Water, water everywhere, but people are going to have a drop to drink, damn it. Okay, now that's a problem. I can't just push it into here. I need to have a pump. <laughs> this is going to be fun. Uh, let's see if we can get this figured out. Pump. Water pump. Big water pumping station, small water pumping station. What's the difference? You have three pumps versus just one. Okay, well, right now I only need the one. So, big water pipe goes into here. Big water pipe goes into here. That works. Um, big water pipe to there. Big water pipe to there. Because you're shifting 127 cubic meters. That might be not great. Okay, hang on. Let's actually... You go... Oh, don't do this to me. Good. Big pipe there. Good. Big pipe up here. Big pipe continuing this direction. Big pipe continuing this direction. Don't do it. Oh, you're going to be a bastard, aren't you? There we go, we crossed over. That's actually kind of cool that I can cross it over that way. That helps a lot. Haha, <laughs> Versailles made you buy it. <laughs> That's awesome. It's, uh... Prepare to enjoy the pain. Only through the pain will you know... Okay, so I can spin off either way. Uh, hook up there, hook up here. Good, good, good. Uh, let's go ahead and do... Big water pipe can split off over to here. We'll allow that. Um, okay, so we need... More water switches. We are creating terminals. So many water terminals. Let's do that. Uh, 
Um, let's see. Big pipe here. Big pipe here. It really is one of the better building sims out there. It's it's super in depth. Now I'm I'm gonna be honest with you guys. The second that uh, City Skylines is out, I'm gonna be lost in the sauce with that one. I am super super excited for that. Some other oh I found the problem. You're the problem child. Okay. Got it. I have enough extra things that I can connect to that at some point this will all be balanced. Uh, this is... This system is some hot garbage, guys. I don't think I did a very good job. Ugh. I do not think I did a good job at all. Um... Oof. I'm looking at it now and I'm kind of like, I kind of hate myself, but I'm not rebuilding it. I'm not going to rebuild it. I'm going to do a better job in the other town. Um, we're going to let this go. And honestly, all of this needs to be built. Um, where is the Vraska office? What is this? Oh, I got a construction office here that I'm, I can't really do anything with because it's just... Yeah, let's, uh, let's fix that. We want to assign... We're going to take that one off, and we're going to assign you guys, as well as all of you. And to assign construction, click this. I want you guys to build all the things here. Get on it. Cool. They're on it. Yeah, Merton is absolutely right. If you're a new player to the game, turning stuff off at the start is totally acceptable because you can go to game settings here. You can change all of your game settings in the middle of a game. So if you start with everything off and you want to add one mechanic at a time and just pile it on until you really know everything, you could totally do that. Or if you are a masochist like me and you just want to start learning by having everything on, that's totally an option too. Um, I have never turned off an option other than... I think there were a couple times I turned fire off just because it was a pain. Hmm. We are exporting 17,000 rubles worth of goods. Container trucks are doing some work. And I'm here for it. Are all of our dumpers out transporting stuff right now? Holy crap, I think they actually are. <clears throat> we're exporting $12,000 worth of goods, but we're importing $37,000 worth of goods. That's because we have a lot of construction, though. Um, it's not long until we are going to have everything else in progress. What's going on with this guy? Are you still not done? Can I... Can I please... Can I... Why? Tell me why. Why was that a thing? I need this to be a high priority because I've got to get something out of here. Uh, I'm gonna tell you that you're gonna load. Tell you what, for right now, 
load, wait until loaded, and unload, wait until unloaded. Go ahead and start that right now. See if that's enough to get this in progress. I bought this vehicle forever ago to try and do this. Okay. Construction waste, metal scrap, other... So you have mixed waste. Do I need to have... I think I need to transfer and I need to mark it to do the different things. Or by having the big transfer... That might be the very first thing they work on. Um, so we need concrete and asphalt done in order to get that completed. Oh, we actually got that done. Um, let's keep working down the line, building asphalt roads. And uh, tell you what, we got an asphalt road on the bottom. We're just going to do a little... We're going to do that number right there. Hold up. I have made a mistake. I have made a critical error. My life depends on getting this crossroad done or getting this done because I just cut off the only way for these guys to get across. Um, what I'll do, actually, no, I can solve that. We'll allow them to move here. Yeah, people got lost. Oops. You know what could actually be interesting? If I ran a road across here, a road across here, here, and here, and I make those one ways heading out from here down, one way out, one way in, one way in, that might be slightly more efficient than what I've been doing. In theory, in theory. That's just a theory. A game theory. Mwahaha. Oh, Brosidon, did you know that if you wanted to get in-depth, um, the road system is complex enough that you can go intersection by intersection telling it whether it will be, you know, just hand yield, if it's going to be a specific type of yield, and it'll set up yield, stop signs, etc., um, or if you want to have proper stoplights. And then on top of that, you can set up individual road signs with waypoints, um, road end of restrictions, speed limits, uh, telling them whether or not they can have buses, cars, pedestrians. You can limit anything you possibly want. Wait, can you place an additional light? Oh my gosh, you actually can. So you can literally plan everything out. Alright, let's get this done because I have a feeling that that's the entire reason this guy is being held up. And if this doesn't do it, I don't know what we need to do. Because this dude's ready to load up. Should I try another type of truck?
Okay, everything's on site. We just need 18 work days, which is going to be a single worker bus. Da, 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 da. I hate that he did the one going in at the bottom and the one leaving from the top, and that was all he did. <laughs> That's literally the most awful way that he could have done this. Well, we did severely reduce the amount of stuff that we were importing because we're not building rails right now, which has severely reduced the amount of everything that we're losing. That's a good thing. Where do you sit right now? Oh, you're actually doing pretty good. You have 190-some tons. Um... I think I want to give this its own dedicated small distribution office. Um, we'll tell five trucks to grab from here and then it will try and prioritize this with a 90% priority and it will move the rest here with a 50% priority. That should be enough to continually pack food to then send out via container. We have 3,000 rubles ready to pack up and go. Oh, was that it? Is he, is he on his way now? Dude figured it out. Okay. Um, let's tell you to come here and delete that. Load, wait until loaded. Yep, we found the problem. Okay. Here's what's awesome about that finally being done. We can fix our mistake from earlier in the game. Let's get... Um, actually, let's do this. Delete those. Great. We want to set all of our semaphores. There we go. Knowing that those are there, now we can grab after the semaphore, which is here. Nope, right there. And we can properly connect this in. done. With that done, it means that we can do a good mix signal. Oh my god. Click the thing. Alright, now the major question is, can I get this to click where I want it to click. Okay, got that one. Got that one. Great. So we have three mixed signals reading in to go out this way. Um, we need a chain signal reading in here. Gosh. Okay. And we need a chain, a double chain signal. Well, no, we want to chain this way. Hang on, how do I want to do this? Do that. 
chain and a straight one out, chain in. All right, and now I think I can actually set these up the proper way. Chain in. Okay, that's good. Now we need to do the same thing on this side. And it is neon green over here. Okay. I might have to get rid of multiple of those while he's building all this stuff. I want you on top of this. I want you to build all of the things here. Man. Oh, he's trying to demolish the tracks over here right now. I mean, that's okay. Should knock that out pretty damn quick. We've got plenty of water for everything here. Everybody seems to be doing all right. How's our school doing right now? We're just not training people very well. What's your major malfunction? You know what? We need a secret police. I think we need secret police here. We need to know what our loyalty is. So for that, we need to do some research. What research do we require? Show me the secret police, comrade. Aha. So we need party member ranking, and then we need secret police. Um, and after that, we can do favorite party members, cars are most loyal, education for the most loyal. Okay. So that's all stuff that we can work on after the fact. And what we really want is we want our school and our headquarters to have the most loyal party members working there. Because they indoctrinate the people up until they get out and it keeps their loyalty higher. That's my understanding. But in order to do that, we need to determine who is loyal? <sighs> the garbage and transfer over here is actually really good. I need to do a similar thing here. Um, right now, mostly I'm just letting these slowly trickle down. We have a lot of construction to work on here. What do these currently have that they're working on? A couple roads. Honestly, I'm going to let them keep working on the roads.
I don't know what's happening here. Is it signaling problems? It might be. Okay, what if for right now I get rid of these signals? Because they might be confusing the train, to be honest. Was that him? I thought I saw him flying past, but it might have been a car. I think I actually had to demolish that to get it to... That worked. Oh, okay. Because it was going to have some waste, I had to demolish enough stuff that it could waste it in order... I, I don't know if I'm making sense. I had to demolish enough stuff here that there was a place for the extra prefab panels that were being wasted. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, turning an early profit for the month, that's good. I could suspend this research on fire helicopters and work on party member ranking. I think I'll do that. I'm a little worried about my overall citizenry. I think I want to grab experts. This might be excessive, but I feel like I need it in order to make sure I'm teaching all of my students. Let's see what that puts us at. We are teaching more people. In fact, honestly, I might completely suspend any research until we are training all of our students. Yeah, some of these people are in their 40s. That's not okay. We have a severe issue of not having enough college trained individuals let's make the school run as efficiently as possible we need nothing but experts for a minute See if we can't get this up. Is it like a one-to-one -one ratio between party officials and students? It almost feels like that, and I don't know why that is. Unless for some reason they're just not being hyper-efficient. Um, 